Right, here we are at uh, Lodge on the island, me and Ollie, doing a little quick one-nighter. Um, I said I'd do Bob's blog part three, which would be on the Fox Exocet Spod system. Um, this thing flies, absolutely flies. We was having a little mess about with it earlier. Um, and I don't know if you can see the A-frame right in the back far there, behind the reed. Um, Basically, if a dude was fishing, in, well, we've got someone fish, fishing in that swim now. If there's another swim just there, that's a disabled swim. Um, we, we was getting it in his swim, easy, easy, um, without any mixing it, just a bit of water. So, um, right. So basically, to start off with, you got a semi-stiff tail. Okay, keeps everything nice and straight. You got four fins, which are solid. They're not going to bend in the wind. Um, it's just a nice solid bit of kit. You've got the little canister which slides up on the inside and the top of it which just screws in like that. You get three of these tops, uh, a yellow one and a black one. You get two of these stiff booms. Um, they are quite difficult to get in. I'll, I'll tell you that now. Um, definitely wet them um, or otherwise you could end, could end up stretching this. Still works. Anyway, right in here, I have got my very carpy spod mix, which we've knocked up over the past couple of days. Um, just right, so we take it apart, we fill up the little canister. Because it's got this semi-stiff boom, if you haven't got a big enough bucket, you'll find it difficult scooping. Okay. Um, I don't think I've got this clipped up at the moment. Oh, I am. So this is where I'm going to be putting the rod later on tonight. I've seen a couple of fish showing out there. Let me just show you how this goes. Shimano Alivio specimen, five and a half pound test curve. Uh, I've got a Shimano Aero 6000 GT. This is a spot reel loaded with braid. A uh, little shock leader. Just a Nash one that I had nothing about. I didn't have any lead core or anything to make up any proper. Same spot because obviously the temperature 
going to drop quite a bit later. So they're not going to be mad for feeding for it, I don't think. There's not much to cast in the dead of night, and this is going to be pitch black. Just get a nice little scattering. So after this next one is I'll take the clip off and uh, just launch it. You can see what it can do. bit of spot mix in it, give it a bit of weight. You don't want to fill it up past that canister really, or otherwise it just all flies out and your bivvy gets covered. Your shelter or whatever you're using, your broiler. really there's no big effort in that and um, yeah the Fox Exocet spot system can't go wrong tenner I don't sell them you have to get them from the local angling shop <laughs> 